Okay, it's time to test your knowledge. For this, we are going to restore to our base config, and then we are going to create some pools, monitors, virtual servers, and profiles. And we'll do this from scratch. To restore your configuration, you'll go to System and then Archives. All right, here we are in our big IP. System, scroll down to Archives, we'll click on that. Uh, before we restore, we want to create a backup config. So we'll create, we'll name it, and then click Finished. And now we will click our base config. And then we'll click Restore. Click OK. OK, sometimes with the trial license, you'll get this message saying that um, there's something wrong with the restore process. In this case, the easiest thing to do is to delete this virtual LTM and just uh, create a new LTM and then just load your base config onto it. Another thing to try is to delete all your backups as we will do here. One of the earlier lectures, I said to save the backup config to your desktop. So if you did that, you could just go to uploads and we could browse for it. And here's my base config. We could open it, upload. And then we'll click on it and restore. OK, in my case, the desktop version that I uploaded was able to restore my device to the base config. Verify it by going to local traffic and virtual servers. And we can see that all of our virtual servers are gone. So now we know the configuration has been restored to the base config. OK, at this point, we can open up the document for this lab and all of the instructions are attached. We can see that we need to create some monitors, some pools, some profiles, a virtual server, and then here's our verification to make sure everything is working. So it's your turn to test your knowledge.